They negotiated treaties with the tribes and established annuity funds in Washington. The agent, the traders, the contractors, claimants could all tap that money and there was so much money to be made. Little Crow had been a chief of the Kaposia Band for about three years when Alexander Ramsey became the first governor of the Minnesota Territory in the spring of 1849. Ramsey immediately joined forces with Henry Sibley to get the Dakota to sign a treaty by which they would cede all of their land west of the Mississippi. The land session is larger than the state of New York and rich, fertile, and beautiful beyond description. Sibley had long awaited this opportunity to recoup a lot of the money that his company had lost over the years. He boasted to his boss, Pierre Chateau, Jr. The Indians are prepared to make a treaty when we will tell them to do so, and such a one as I may dictate. No treaty can be made without our claims being first secured. Sibley decided that the commissioners should meet with the Upper Dakota first at Traverse des Sioux. Little Crow watched as the Upper Dakota were hurried into making this treaty. He later learned that the chiefs had been deceived into signing a trader's paper. By this paper, Sibley was able to claim all of the debt money that he wanted to, a total which came to $145,000, which is several million dollars in today's money. Afterward, the commissioners, Ramsey and Luke Lee, came up to Mendota here, to Sibley's house and held meetings with the Lower Dakota chiefs. Little Crow was obstinately opposed to making a treaty unless the commissioners first forked over $30,000 of back money owed the tribe from the Treaty of 1837. We will talk of nothing else but that money. If it is until next spring, that lies in the way of the treaty. The chiefs then discussed the boundaries of the proposed reservation on the upper Minnesota River. Little Crow demanded that the southern boundary of the reservation extend down to Traverse des Sioux. And when he thought that the commissioners had acceded to this request, he volunteered to be the first to sign the treaty. 